let's uh, take a quick look at this power inverter. Now this is an inverter off of a Gen 3 Prius. And this is really kind of where all the magic of the hybrid drivetrain happens. It really happens in inside this assembly. And we'll talk about some of the, the things that are on here. Right here you can see we have uh, connectors for the computer controls. And so uh, there, are, there are controls inside here, but there are also other control modules that, that uh, communicate with what's going on in here. So that all happens through these ports here. If we look here at the top, and we pull this cover off. This is where all of our high voltage connections are. So we've got our connections for our motor generators here and here. And these are three phase AC connections. That's what the motor generator runs off of. And that's what it produces when it's in generator mode. So for uh, our two motor generators, these are our hookups. Over here is where the high voltage comes in. Um, to the um, or from the high voltage battery so that hooks up here the there's there's only two cables because of course being a high voltage battery it is DC power and so there are two connections there um, these two connections here uh, go down to the um, AC compressor the AC compressor also runs off a high voltage it is an, an electric compressor it does not run off of um, it's not driven by a belt it's got its own, its own, its own HV motor. Um, this terminal down here where this cable is cut off, this is your 12 volt output. So inside the power inverter, we're not just taking the 220 volts of, of DC and converting it to the, um, the AC to run our motor generators, but we also have a DC to DC converter that takes that 220 volts DC, steps it down to about 14 volts DC. And so that's what comes out on this terminal here. So this cable actually goes up and hooks up to the um, to the uh, the fuse relay box or the junction block under the hood of the vehicle. Over here, you can see there's a there's a pipe here. There's another one over on the other side. That is for the coolant. All right. So the electronics in here are liquid cooled. There is a separate cooling system for the the power inverter and for the motor generators and that is where that hooks up there. Here's the other side, okay, the other pipe that comes out the other, the other end. We're going to actually tear into this inverter. We're going to take it apart since it's, it's a known bad unit. We're going to take it apart and actually have a look at the guts of this thing. And that will be a subject for another video. But pretty amazing all the technology that goes into just this power inverter that's located under the hood of Gen 3 Prius. There's, there's quite a bit that's going on there.